Welcome back. Today's Anuvaka discusses about heaven. ಅಯಜ್ಞೋಪಾಯಜೋಧಾಮೋಪ್ರಯಂತೋಧಾಮೋಪ್ರಯಂತೋಧಾಮೋಪ್ರಯಂತೋಧಾಮೋಪ್
other than this world itself. So, don't be fooled by the marketing of heaven by the Semitic religions. The Sanadana Dharma and the Vedic texts clearly say that live this world, live in this world in an active way and be helpful to all the others. That way you can attain Soma the bliss and the heavenly bliss in this world itself. You need not go around killing other people and converting people to attain heaven. You can lead a good life in this world and have a heavenly bliss. The Veda tells us always that the life on this planet is a continuation. You continue the life of your ancestors and the life is continued through your children. That is why the Vedas instruct us to do Sapindi Karana and other rituals. Welcome back. Today's Anivaka is a prayer for a happy family life. From Vedic time onwards, we had domesticated many animals like the cow, sheep and horse and also many other animals. And this Anuvaga tells us to be nice to them. It also tells us that we should teach our children to be nice with these animals. And interestingly, this Anuvaka is applicable nowadays because it talks of not being too much workaholic. It says, don't be too much attached to your gadgets and work and spend time, quality time with family and children. It then also prays for getting intelligent and healthy children. We all know that if only the children are intelligent and healthy, 
we can have a good family life. So this Anuvaka is a prayer to the Almighty for begetting good, intelligent and healthy children are for and for a happy family life. And it also tells us that we should recite Gayatri Mantra regularly. Gayatri Mantra chanted regularly gets knowledge and also it gets you good life and energy. This Anuvaka ends with telling us that sharing is caring. And in the upcoming Anuvaka, the Rishi tells us how to be successful in our life. So stay tuned and kindly subscribe to this channel. Thank you.